it seems as though you're not quite satisfied with how to finish, though. Yeah. With, so Robbie got his ovation. Oh, yeah. Yes. Not, not that it was, oh, Robbie got this, I wanted this as well. Yeah. But just that their way it finished with the FAI left a little bit of a sour taste. Yeah. Yeah, I just didn't think there was, I didn't even get a phone call at the FAI. Do you know what I mean? It's weird. Like, and I don't know. I mean, I don't know if Kev's had a phone call at the FAI, you know, or Duffer or Dunny or any of these players that, that's retired and sort of the same kind of era. I don't know. But I just felt that, the, you know, they could have at least picked the phone up and said, mm. you know, you know, thanks for your efforts. Like, yeah. It was over 20 years of my life, you know. I wasn't asking for a parade down the middle of Dublin like with me sitting on the front of a <laughs> lead lorry well, or so something. You're, you're, you're like, you would think you're such an asset to the FAI. Here's a guy from Donegal who yeah. did, who went and lived the dream. Yeah. You, anyone can do it. Yeah, yeah, I suppose, but I don't know. I mean, you need to ask someone at the FAI, but I just felt that it was just, I don't know, maybe I didn't deserve nothing. Maybe that was just the way, that, you know, that it is. But, you know, there was a bit of needle of John Delaney and my dad. I write about that in the book and... Years gone by after the game and stuff, and and I don't know if he's got a grudge against me because of because of something my dad said or something. I don't know. I just I just I just don't feel it. What was it with your dad? It was after one of the games. I think and the you know the FEI at the time were were sort of laying off loads of people, and a reporter asked me dad. I think he had a few beers or something after one of the games and stuff, and he's just said like, well, my dad suddenly, oh, well, John Denny should take a pay cut, like because all these people are losing their jobs and all this kind of stuff, and and. He was in the front page of the one of the newspapers, the mm. national newspapers, and Shay Gavin's dad <laughs> says, John Delaney. You're on the phone to him. Do you know what, what are you doing? Yeah. Well, I am, but at the same time, then this popped up in a meeting. I was on for bonuses, I think, maybe for 2012. Me, John O'Shea, Robbie Keane were done talking to John Delaney, and he's, we're talking about bonuses for the whole squad, like as, you know, as a senior group of players and stuff. And he pops up saying, about What about your dad saying this and this and that? And I was raging, like, fuming. So, what the, what's that got to do with me? Like, do you know what I mean? Mm. Because I can't stop my dad. You can say what he wants, or, you know. Yeah. People that we can, you know, and in a sense, he kind of got stitched up a little bit as well. And it was, it wasn't the right time or place for even that conversation. We're talking about something totally different, and then he just ran and comes out of the blue. You know what I mean? So I don't know if there's a bit of history there. I suppose maybe there is, but um, I just felt that I could have had a phone call of somebody, even the president of the FBI or something. Surely mm. somebody could have rung me. Kev. Yeah. I Did didn't get, get a, I, I didn't get a phone call. No, I, I didn't, get a, didn't get a phone call. call. So I feel a lot yeah. better now. Yeah. No, I, I, I would say as well. It was. I remember the night that you and I together we met our hundredth cap together against yeah. uh, against Montenegro, wasn't it? And it was still. I, I remember that day was just an Im- incredibly emotional day. Uh, Brian McCarthy had done a video for for the two of us, hadn't yeah. everything out. I, I was crying from about three o'clock that afternoon, yeah. and it was it was just a weird day for me personally. And it, the game was meaningless in the end because yeah. we, we'd already we'd already hit the playoff then. But it was it was uh, it was a strange time around then as well. I think for me from a personal point, but it was it, that that day in particular, particularly something that we can share together. It was yeah, it, it was, was, it was very mind, unique, yeah. I think, probably because there's not too many that. That would have had uh, made the hundredth cap no, together no, on the same I mean, night. You speak of a stand before making a hundred caps. Remember, we were, was it? In, was yeah, that in Japan. World Cup, was it? Yeah. In Japan, yeah. and like we were just like, oh my god, he's made hundred caps. Couldn't believe it. And then me and him made the same night. Which yeah, was very special. Like, but no, nah, I don't know. I mean, he didn't get a phone call, so I'm f- I feel a lot better now after that. <laughs> <I guess. laughs>